Hey everyone, Azur28 aka Alu here. Happy New Year of 2023. I got something a little bit different this time. The setup is in. There we go. We're in Windows XP. And I've recently managed to build together a Windows XP machine, which is almost the ultimate Windows XP machine. Like if we grab the specs here, they clearly show that we have a GTX 780 installed, which is the second best gaming GPU that Windows XP supports. 780 Ti being the most powerful one, unless there's a way to modify the drivers to actually give the XP support for the newer NVIDIA card. This is the most powerful thing there is for XP outside of the 780 Ti. I could, there's a possibility that I'll get one later in the, in the January, but right now this is almost it. And then we have the most powerful CPU that the XP supports, that being Intel Core i7 3770K. Pretty awesome stuff. Although it's only a 32-bit operating system, so I'm limited to 4 gigs of RAM. But this is probably going to also be my multi-boot machine, which will have like tons of operating systems in it. Anyway, this Windows XP, it needs to be activated naturally, because there's a 30-day limit on how long you can use Windows before you have to activate it. It will refuse to activate. So we're not going to use the internet, we're going to... Just the option of call the customer service. We'll see if Windows XP can still be activated in 2023. So we gotta select our location. Well, as you can see from the language, if you recognize it, you should. I'm really surprised if you don't. If you're a viewer of mine, but we're of course gonna select Finland and we gotta grab the Number to the customer service. Hold up. Have I saved it already? No. Okay. Oh, yeah, it feels like it's gonna change, but the upper one is like it's the free number and then The paid number is right here below and Oh god those installation IDs are very fucking long So let's get that below the key keyboard up properly <laughs> I'm not sure if the camera is gonna focus on my phone it might be too bright but we have the proper phone number let's give him a call We're ready to hear some finish well thank you for the welcome Whoa. What the fuck? <laughs> that was the EULA for do you want this do you consent for the call being recorded? <laughs> Alright, so activate Windows press one, okay? Oh So it just uh, said that if you want to activate Windows 10 or 11, press 1. It used to only say if you want to activate Windows 10. They've changed something since the last time I actually did this. So we press the other. Yeah, we have the activation window open. Alright, here we go. Oh god. Alright, so. so the first group of number from the installation ID. So 039964, okay. This is an OEM license that I'm actually using. Oh boy. 0123. I'm really sorry that I cannot capture this for you. 
from the phone. 683912. Okay. Seven eight 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 oh five. Four hundred eight and then five sixty. Two nine five six thirty five. Okay. Six nine eight one two one. Oh six. Two seven eleven. Oh four three four six four. If I'm not mistaken, this Windows license has been upgraded to Windows Seven and activated on Windows Seven at some point. So we'll see how it does. All right. So Group A. Yeah, we have a keyboard here. Like the caller or the automation asks you. Alright, so party. Press one for being ready. Let's go. Okay, yep, we got it, we got it. Sorry, I really gotta focus on this. Okay. Oh, there's some... There's some delay because of the HDMI splitter with my inputs. God, I hate it. to repeat everything. Okay, so O Oops. Sorry, my mistake. I want to repeat everything. Oh have they changed this? No. Don't want to repeat the last one. No, we're not ready. Go back, press three. Ah, start from the beginning, press 4. O five six three four five. Check. B. Retracer number 255. Five. Okay. Then C. O eight six two nine. Zero. Yeah, that checks out. Come on, give me the Alright. E. Oh, yeah, the easy one. It's the one, it's still right. Five five seven eight seven three. And five one nine five nine zero. All right. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Alright. Wait. 
And is there an activation prompt? No, there isn't. You can still activate Windows XP in 2023. <laughs> At least as of January, January 2nd of 2023, but it's 2023. <laughs> All right, guys. That was a quick one and that's gonna do it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.